Hi, this is Scary Star Being with Scary's Wide World of Mystery. Aries, I am doing this reading for you for the upcoming Libra season. Libra is your opposite sign. Um, if you have an Aries rising, it resides in your seventh house of relationships, partnership, and marriage. Um, I, I had already started your video but it got interrupted by a phone call which caused the video to stop recording and instead of making a part one and a part two I decided to just uh, rehash what I was saying here <laughs> so that it can be all part of one video I already shuffled and laid out the cards all right let's get back to the first card here we have Queen of Pentacles and she is possible earth sign influence Taurus Virgo or Capricorn okay doesn't have to be uh, can be any sign of course but this person whether it is you or somebody else it looks like she's waiting for somebody to accompany her she's like saving somebody's spot right next to her okay so either you are waiting on somebody to join you on your throne or somebody is waiting for you to join them on their throne um, let's see what else can we notice about this beautiful Queen of Pentacles I wanna say it looks like whoever this is they're they're watching you or you're watching them pretty intently like they've got their focus very intently upon whomever it is that they would like to take play to take their not take their place but to take their place next to them on this throne okay and I'm also noticing this uh, pentacle right here that she's holding right next to her heart so I'm getting that this is probably a love situation all right so either you're in love with somebody or somebody's in love with you or you're both in love with each other which is what I hope is the case right Okay, we have Page of Cups. I'm getting a vibe of somebody withholding something. Like somebody maybe wants to give you a message of love, Aries, but uh, they're having to watch their back for some reason. Okay? They're having to guard this cup of love very carefully and it looks like whoever it is they're headed your direction okay they're definitely headed towards you 333 three, three. but they're doing so very cautiously I'm almost getting that maybe they're afraid that something would sabotage them being able to come towards you, possibly. We have three of pentacles. I'm getting third party situation. This doesn't have to mean infidelity, okay? This doesn't even have to mean that this person is already taken, okay? Or has anybody on the side. This could be this could be work getting in the way of some sort of union or reunion, okay? Like, they could be sneaking away from work to take a vacation with you somewhere. But, you know, I also have to come back to the possibility that this could be that this person is already taken and they are in a third party situation and they are afraid that 
they would have to sneak away from a partner in order to be with you. Okay. And, you know, these readings are general, so take whatever I say that makes sense for you in your situation and hold on to that and the rest with a grain of salt. This could also be uh, you wanting to sneak away from a job that you have currently to another job that seems more promising, Aries. Whatever this situation is for you, okay, I'm seeing Mars and Capricorn there, okay? I just thought I would point that out. So yeah, I definitely think that for a decent group of you, this could be work-related. In the Five of Swords, yeah, this is, this is torturing you mentally. <laughs> this really, you really, you know, you're really in your head about this and you're really conflicted, okay? Should I stay or should I go? Um, yeah, should I stay or should I go now is what I'm hearing. Uh, if I go, there will be trouble. If I stay, there will be double. Anyway, uh, <laughs> at least I didn't sing to you. Anyway. <laughs> We have Venus and we have Aquarius right there. And five is a number of change. So, um, yeah. I want to say make the change. Because even though change can be scary, it's better than being stuck in this, right? It's better than being stuck in that nonsense. So, go within for a little while see what your heart tells you and then take that leap of faith Aries that's the reading as always I am wishing you the very best um, I love your faces and I will talk to you later bye